All right, here we are, ladies and gentlemen, Grind Time Season 2. This year we're kicking off the first episode with one of our annual fundraisers, and today we're honoring a guy named Al Magini, who is a legend and a leader in Sonoma County. He's 102 years old, ladies and gentlemen. He's going to be 103 in August, and today he's being interviewed by legendary uh, columnist and historian Gay LeBaron. So we're super excited. Tonight is all about raising money for our kids and the program, uh, providing meal money and uniforms. And so everybody, uh, we're hoping that they, that, that they loosen up those pocket strings and uh, are generous with their checks. And we raise a lot of money for our student athletes today. And, and so this is a great way to kick off the year. We do it every year. And it kind of starts the momentum for our football season coming in. So here we go, Grind Time Season 2, Episode 1. Okay. This is a legend, man. This is a legend. Thank you. Harrison, go stand right behind us. I've got 23. Do I hear 20? Do I hear 24? Do I hear? I've got 24 now. Hey, 3,000. 3,000. 3,000. 3,200 dollars sold. It's great to see all of you turn out for a couple of centenarians, Al Magini and Santa Rosa Junior College, yeah. <laughs> over 100 now. Um, Al, as you probably are aware, is the league leader in that contest of being 100 years old because he's older than that. But both have birthdays in September, and Al will be 103. Oh, the college yeah. only 100. You know, and I would be very hard pressed at this juncture to say which one is the most respected in this community. Yes. Uh, it's it's a it's a toss up. You know, you don't wish war on anybody. I know. I and the and the last and if you've ever been in it, you sure and hell don't when you see your. Uh, we I was flying in one place. Over Merzberg, it was a it was a uh, 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 oil refinery at Merzberg near Leipzig, and we lost. We sent in uh, thirty six airplanes, and we lost nine of them. Jesus. And the guy on my wing blew up. He he got a direct hit, and, and he was right over here, he was right here, and uh, the, the airplane was right there. And it isn't fun, but uh, it was a, uh, it's a tremendous experience, I'll tell you that. And I, I'll say this to anybody, and I think some of you here will believe, if you get in the service, or young people get in the service, and, um, and you do what you're supposed to do, and you don't fight it, you'll get an awful lot out of the Navy, the Army, or the Marine Corps, or the Air Forces, or as, as, it's now, as it is now. You get an awful lot of it. And the other thing is, I was a guy that didn't have 
very much confidence in myself. My, both my brothers were more, much more intelligent than I was. And I was a, the smartest guy that ever came down the street, I'm gonna tell you that. But uh, all of a sudden you come out of the air, they stick me in an airplane, you got a responsibility to get in that airplane there and you get it back again. Yeah. And you go and do it and you go up the ladder. And, uh, but you don't fight anything. Jesus. If I talk to another person. No, no, probably, no, no, Probably no, no, no. not, probably no. not, but. Uh, but. Anyway, uh, I, uh, I appreciate uh, you, uh, the, what you're doing for the, uh, doing for the college. Well, now, I, wait a minute, you're not through. Balance bothered me, uh, bothers me right now, in this part of my life, but, uh, more than anything else. And we worked very hard on that. And to try and stay in some kind of shape so that you uh, you can get around and not... And I'll tell you, I just got through with a couple of bangs on the head and a trip fell down. I don't want to go through that crap. But anyway, I just got through three or four months of it and just got my automobile back. I couldn't, they wouldn't let me drive. And I gotta tell you something, it is, it ain't fun. After you've been, you, it, 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 all your life, you know, you've been uh, active and doing things. So you gotta stay active. And I don't give up, don't give up workouts, I'll tell you that right now. The best thing in the world. Ow, ow, tell them what you, tell them what you drive, tell them what you drive. Porsche, a, 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 19, a 1912 GTS. Wisdom that you get got from your mother or your father? From my mom. My, my dad died when we were all very young. and uh, But from my mother, two things. You never discuss a woman you go out with. <laughs> You don't go to the boys and tell it. Wow. I give them a big thing. Never, do, to I, I, never that. do that. <laughs> and the other thing you do, you uh, do everything in moderation. Yeah. yeah that's now, good. unfortunately, the, this I, I, I did some. There were a few times when moderation didn't work with me. But anyway. Um, last question. Last question. Uh, and I'm going to ask you, and you're going to try. Uh, give me a sense. Uh, give me an an, a real answer. Do you have a secret to living as long as you've lived? What's what's your secret? That is now. That's besides having a martini, yeah. real gin. Uh, you know, it's up. <laughs> what, what's besides that? Well, you know, you're taking everything away from me. Yeah. <laughs> oh God! Uh, anything besides that? What else? <laughs> I enjoy I enjoy being with people. I enjoy uh, uh, I don't I, I think I I, I I don't know what I can give to society, but I I, I I I try I try very hard. I have one big thing that 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 impre that I, I it's impre impregnated into my being so much is to going and helping people. And helping poor people. I don't want to. I don't want to. Uh, I, I, I did a, a few things at the at the hosp hospital, and uh, and the. I, I just want to help people like mothers with children and no fathers, and uh, uh, yeah. that's what I'd like to do for the rest of my whatever days I have, good days I have left. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That was amazing. That's a, a hero. Thank you. Wow. You're a hero. You're a hero. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Yeah, when I got you. Al, we can't thank you enough, man. Our football team thanks you, and we're looking forward for you to be down on the field. Game two, we're at, we got Butte coming in. I'm looking forward to a couple of third down plays from you. Okay? Yeah. Yeah, make them up. You guys, one more time, let's give a big round of applause for Mr. Al McGee.
And one last person I would really like to thank you guys and, and, and just please um, would love to see you guys back here at this event next year. We've already figured out who the next legend and leader of Sonoma no. County is going to be. No. Miss Gayla Barron. We will work out the terms later. Thank you all for being here tonight. Again, we appreciate your support so much. And uh, thank you, Gay, and thank you, Al. Everybody be safe on your way home, and we look forward to seeing you at a game this year. Go Bear Cubs! Who? Uh, okay, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> we'll have to edit that. Yeah, I ain't to edit that. There you go. Yeah. A little something. Potatoes, little chickens, little steaks, a little something. Oh, good night. Man, it's a good night, man. Met, met a gay guy named Al. Great things. Oh, yeah. Lots of things. Hey, turn around, ladies and gentlemen. We're on camera. Ready? Turn around, bro. <laughs> These are my dudes. <laughs> Yo! Love you, man. I'd just like to thank all the generous people of Sonoma County for showing up tonight and showing up for the Bear Cubs. Uh, it's grind time, it's code blue, but it's also community, man, and that's what we're all about. And we're about giving back and doing what we can for the community. And we're super thankful for all these people that stepped up tonight and uh, opened up their pocketbooks and their checkbooks for the Bear Cubs. Thank you. Go Bear Cubs. Here we go.